Hey guys, welcome back to the YouTube channel Programming Knowledge. In today's Microsoft Excel tutorials video, we are going to see and use two important features of the Microsoft Excel. And these features are the paste special feature and the speak cells feature. Now both of these features have utmost importance and they are provided by the Microsoft Excel itself. So you do not need to just do anything special to use these features only you can just follow some steps to use these built-in features of the microsoft excel software itself now we are going to see that what these features are and how can we use them separately and what is the advantage that they give to us in the microsoft excel workbook so first of all we are going to take a look at the paste special feature and then we are going to take a look at the other feature that is the speak cells feature of microsoft excel so first of all we will talk about the paste special feature so as the name suggests this is a feature that enables you to paste the data now what is its importance uh, its importance can be understood simply by here i have a table which has a single column by the name as name and there are some names present over in this column so I just copy this data, uh, just select this data, then press Ctrl C to copy it. And then I just go to same other cell and press Ctrl V to paste it. Then as soon as I do, this is the kind of the output that I got. Whatever the data was there, it has been copied. Whatever the formatting was there, it has been copied. But the only problem is that whatever the width of the cell was previously, of that case cell it has been not changed and my data is looking messy so to arrange it i will just double click over here and then it has been arranged but what if i just don't want to just use this double click option and i just want that the exact width of the cell to be pasted or what if i only want to just copy my data or what if only i just want to copy my formatting so in that case a special kind of a paste feature is what we are going to use and that feature is known as the paste special feature now this paste special feature is present in the home tab and in the home tab you can see in the clipboard group this paste option so this is the uh, place from where you can access this paste special feature of microsoft excel so once you have copied the data you can just go to any cell where you want to paste now here what do i want to paste is only my formatting that is the first that is the column heading should be in green and the text should be written in white and the rest of the things with a gray background and black foreground color so what i do is i just select this destination cell then i just click on this arrow option so as soon as i click that you can see these are the various kinds of option paste options that i get now in this paste option i just only want to paste the formatting so in the other paste option there is an option of formatting as soon as i click on that you can see that only the formatting has been pasted now if you want to check it you can just double click on the cell you can type in anything like data anything and you will see that the formatting has been copied as it is so that is how you can just copy and paste the formatting as it is of the data using the paste special feature now the second thing is if you just want to paste the data and not the formatting so again i just select any cell and before that i just need to copy this data once again just select any of the cells then go to paste and here I only want to paste the data. So what I will do is uh, here is an option in the paste values group that is the values option. So I just click on it and only the values or the data is now pasted without any formatting. And if you can just double click, you can see that there is no formatting applied and you can now apply any formatting as per your choice or as per your wish. Now the other thing is what if we want to just paste this data as it is. So with the formatting with the exact data and with the exact width of the cell now you can see in the g cell that uh, its width is more and in the o cell where we want to paste the data its width is less so again go to this paste special options and here you will find an option of keep source column widths so as soon as you click on that you can see that exact copy of the data has been created along with the formatting along with the data and along with the width of the cell as well 
so this is the importance of the paste special feature it reduces your time considerably and it can be used very effectively in a variety of places now this is uh, what the paste special feature is all about now what we are going to do is um, learn about any other feature of microsoft excel and that is the speak sales feature so before that i'm just going to uh, organize my data a little bit like this all right and these rest of the things i'm just going to delete okay so these are the uh, data that i have kept for the use of the speak sales feature how can we use the speak sales feature so to use this speak sales feature first of all go to files and here you will find options and in the options you will find an option called quick access toolbar now in this quick access toolbar you got to search for speak sales got to select all commands option and then just you can go and select for speak sales feature okay so here is the speak sales feature so i'm just going to select the speak sales speak stopping speak sales by column speak sales by rows and speak sales on enter and then click on okay now as soon as you do that you can see that some of these options have been added on the quick access toolbar then what you got to do is just make sure to turn this feature on but before that you got to make sure that your computer is not on the mute mode as mine was so i have just turned off this mute option then uh, you can just click on it so this is the speak sales feature it by default moves in a row format that is row by row uh it first spoke this thing then this and then came on to this next row so that is the speak sales feature and by pressing this speak sales start you can start the sales speaking and just beside it it's a stop speaking sales option so you can use that to make sure that the sales have stopped speaking now if you want them to move in a different format that is by column to column format you can just select this option over here select your desired uh, data and then start Josh Lambert Sheldon B Cooper Leonard Wolowitz Howard Stark Bruce Shaw James L Thompson Tom B Pratt name Josh Lambert So that's how you can make it move on a column by column format Now there is another a uh, way through which you can make your cells speak and that is cell speak on enter so when you select this option this is what it will say and what will you do is just type in any data and press enter and as soon as you press enter then the cells will speak again if we just type apple it's a speaking and now if we just type in ball now what if if we type any other thing like cat then it also speaks so as soon as you enter any data whether you present or press a tab key or an enter key the cells would be spoken when the cell speak on enter feature is turned on now if you want you can just turn this feature off like just clicking on it again and it would give you a voice message that you have now turned off the cell speak on the enter option now if you want uh, you can just um keep your cursor on any other thing and uh you can even just click on this data and present and just so that is how uh, the cells would start speaking and uh, one more thing if you just keep your cursor over here and just click on speak cells again Josh Lambert Sheldon B Cooper Leonard Wolowitz Howard Stark Bruce Shaw James L Thompson Tom B Pratt 
then these two datas were present in a side by side fashion so that is why there uh, once the column was over then the second column started but this data is present after a break of two columns and that's why it was not started as soon as this data was over so if you want to do that you can just uh, copy them from here and you can just paste it over here now if you just pre uh, just move your cursor over here and click on speak cells so that is uh, when this all this data is now selected in a gray fashion and the cells would be speaking it so for the cells to speak the data you need them to be present in a side by side fashion or in an adjacent manner only then it would be spoken otherwise the link would be broken as soon as there is a blank cell encountered after the cell filled with data is spoken so that is the usage and the advantage of two important features of Microsoft Excel, the paste special feature and the speak sales feature. I hope you all have enjoyed this video. For more such tutorials, keep watching the YouTube channel Programming Knowledge. Till then, goodbye.